Hey guys, guess who's back for some more reacts? It is I, Wolfkill, here to do some more reactions. And then look what just came out on my radar. It is Hell of a Boss, Truth Seekers, Season 1, Episode 6. Wow, we're on the 6th episode, number 6th episode. This is going to be good. I get to see more of my darling, precious Luna. She better get more screen time in this. Seriously, I, I, like, I, I need to see more of her. All right, so I think the last time we, we were dealing with Stryker and there was this whole thing about seeing Millie's parents and that was a cool thing to do, but let's see what they go with this episode. Will Stryker come back? He wants more revenge. Maybe. Who knows? But we're going to be jumping into this. Guys, if you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up, like, and subscribe to it, and also support the official release. Links are in the descriptions down below. Now, without further ado, let's do this. I'm so excited. All right, here we go. Somebody's been keeping track of them. Of our little imps. Right there. This was the first sighting. They are definitely from hell. Uh-oh. They must use this dark magic to cross over into our world. Well, some look who's being spoiled. Specifically targeted people. But why? They always attack at random. Oh the country there's no way to predict where well i guess it makes sense they were bound to be noticed while the activity they, they've been doing so it makes sense that they would oh uh, well that's convenient that is very convenient Shh, remember we can't be seen you're you're not being very Part inconspicuous there blitz you're currently being the loudest i said shush your dick sucking lips moxie <laughs> the lips he's sucking is millie's uh-oh what are they, imp hunters? Demon hunters? They don't left the homies! Alright guys! Oh! Oh! Box! No! Come on Blitz, let's go! There you go! Get out of here! Yo, say what you want about Blitz, but he always got Boxy's back! Super badass. They're so proud of themselves. Oh, poor Bills. Oh, oh poor Billy. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Ah. You, uh, yes. you okay there? No. What are you doing sitting there? The boys are in trouble. Open it again. Blitz was using a total of zero euphemisms, innuendos, or swears. That means it was serious, which means I don't open it until. Open the fucking portal. She's now. not playing. Loot, oh, my ba- Loot, oh, okay, ladies, let's do it, ladies. It's go time. It smells like they went oh, she's so Come on, let's find the dumb So hot. Oh, well, you can find me any day of the week, Luna. Any day of the week, all right, all right. So our boys have been captured. They've been captured awake, huh, by fella? some organization. Has been for a while now. Who oh, are you people? Right? I took a fuck ton of tranquilizers in the college I dropped out of. Also, I've been strapped nipple first to a car battery. I'm, I, oh, okay. I'm Tell sure you have. Scum. Who do you work for? Satan? How did you get to <laughs> so they're not important enough to work for Satan. Why are you killing humans? When did you show up here? Okay, I'm gonna stop you right there, bitch. First of all, <laughs> we just woke up from a love the casual of this. So I'm just gonna stop it right there, bitch. Woozy, so I'm gonna request you fetch us some coffee before we get into this. I mean, everyone gets coffee in shitty movies with scenes like this, am I right? I want something iced, bitch, Mox. I'll have a Neapolitan cappuccino, more cap than Chino. Make sure it's got no more than four ounces of milk. The beans won't have the right texture otherwise. And make okay, sure you're being a little too picky, Mox. You're being a little bit too picky. A, a little cappuccino would have been fine. Misto. Please use soy milk with two blonde shots, affogato and ristretto. I'd also love three vanilla pumps at the very bottom, then add the coffee after. Jesus. Goddamn Christ, Mox. Wow, I was getting massive douche chills just there, Mox. Congrats. If we have to, we are willing to resort to torture methods to get answers out of you nasty hell beasts. When you say torture, do you mean physical or psychological? Or sexual. We would like to tell you I, I, I can be sexually tortured by the female. And you would have no way of knowing what was true. Or we might like it too much, and then you've got a whole new thing to deal with. True. What do you mean by that? Ah, you're stupid, huh? I could work with stupid daddy likey. Uh, no. <laughs> Can what, sir? Daddy likey. You better stop laughing at us. Yeah. You are the ones at our mercy. It's hard to resist. I'm really sorry. 
I mean, considering your approach thus far, you've had us tied here for what, hours? And you haven't even had us confirm what exactly we are. What are you? I'm a Virgo. <laughs> Virgo. Oh, smart guy, eh? One more quip out of you and we'll shut you up. Oh, getting kinky. <laughs> we aren't playing any of vile demon kinks. I mean, that's what it sounded like back there, you sicko. You sick bastards. Why not? I, I love the sass of this episode. I'm loving this sass. Calm down, one. Don't let these monsters get to you. Monsters? Hey, well, that a bit of racist. Call, call, well, that entirely depends. Who are you gonna call? Hmm? Your fat mom taking her for a fat time. Nice try, demon. His fat mom is dead. Why? Why? Why you gotta do like that? <laughs> why? This where they ended up? I think so. Fuck! This looks intense. How are we gonna get in? You look intense, Luna. Beer. You sexy, sexy wolf, you. Nice, nice. And Millie always looks good. I don't need to talk about Millie, because Millie's always looked good. Millie's, Millie's, she's ride or die like you. All right, ladies. Let's get it going. Woo! There we go. Get us some Luna and Millie action. Go, ladies! Go! Oh! That's, that's what, oh, you're so sexy. Oh, that's hot. That's so hot. Oh! Feel like a shuriken! Well, they're dead. Yep. Damn, you're pretty agile for an old lady. I'm like five years older than you. You're not that old. I... <laughs> hey, hey, let's just leave them here until they feel like talking. Wow. Wow, guys. So how are you getting out of this? Don't worry, Mox. If we keep being obnoxious, they'll eventually slip up and we'll get a chance to get out. Let's just keep fucking with them until they get so frustrated they stop thinking clearly. It usually works. Hmm. So the demons want to play games, huh? Well, they're not oh, totally incompetent. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Not the truth, Bob. About Millie. She'll be on her way by now, I'm sure. Ugh, she'll be fine, Moxie. It would take a roided-up hippo to take down that woman when she's upset. We've never dealt with the human government before. She's in danger. Uh, do you ever honestly shut up about Millie? It's always, oh, how's Millie? I can't tonight. I'm hanging with Millie. I'm so worried about Millie. And she's always five fucking feet away from you. It's pathetic. That was oddly personal. Yeah, you're yeah, right. It was. I don't know why the fuck I just let my gut spill like that. I mean, usually you're a dick, but you're not that much of a dick. It's the truth, Bob! Fuck. What the hell is this? I think it's some kind of airborne truth-telling serum. Oh, you just guess that's what it is? Well, uh, it makes just sense. Ask something specific I wouldn't normally tell you. Okay, uh, does Millie ever peg you? Sometimes. Woo! I knew it! I knew it! Oh, it's confirmed! It's confirmed! <laughs> wow. Wow. I actually feel Moxie's pain you on that. You like that musical I recommended to you. I lied. I left halfway through. You, you said Damn. You loved it. it was awful, Moxie. It was about ugly, horny cats. Oh, <laughs> I've said so many lies. <laughs> this is gonna be a good night. I got a feeling <laughs> that tonight's gonna be a good. Oh my. Get it? Uh-oh. I'm not liking how this is going. Okay, yeah, he's definitely dreaming because you shouldn't be up from your chair. Mox? Mox! Blitz? <coughs> I can't see. What's with this, God, what the, what this piano music? What's that music? Is that you? Is this a prank? Because I swear to say... It Satan. is no prank, bitch. What hey. the fuck is, is that? Because you, my precious little bitch boy. Stop this is not some fan of the opera crap. Oh my god, this is Phantom of the Opera. I've never tried acid shrooms or DMT. It's oh my fault. Of course, Blitz, this would be your fault. My lungs are full of honesty. No. Don't you do it, Box. Don't you Damn it! Not trying to divulge too much, but I'm in too deep. So first of all, fuck you! This 
is just typical. Well, two can play at this game of dismay. Because if you're here causing frustration, I'm torturing you. What? I don't want to like this. But I kind of like it. Okay, this, this is more my speed. Oh, is he back in his clown outfit? Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, I don't like it. I simply follow your order. I like that. Is it my fault if your order is that is that is that is interesting art style they're going with here. Very nice. Why are you talking like that? What the fuck does that even mean? I am simply speaking Satan's plain English. Perhaps you should crack open a dictionary sometime, and then maybe you can understand half of the frivolous things I can all and all about. They are going insane right now. I can imagine what the real bodies are doing in the real world. Shut up! Why do you hurt me? Very so interesting animation choices. Why must you push me through this? With your toxic routine. I don't know. Eventually everyone goes. Because you're thoughtless and cruel and you'll end up alone. And me, my dear box, you don't know what you are doing half the time. And you depend on me and the missus to manage your foolish flights of fancy. I don't need you. I can do this shit on my own so easily. Can you though, Blitz? But you don't, don't want to do things alone, though. You tried to sell that way. It didn't work out so well. Oh boy, all of his demons coming out. Yet you still shove away anyone who gets too close until they resent That's, that's kind of hot. Oh yeah, Blitz's nightmare is just insane. They're gonna wrap him up, aren't they? Are you afraid to love people, ah! Blitzy? This is his worst nightmare! He's getting wrapped in bondages! was a haunting oh yeah that's how their body looks that was haunting seeing moxie dressed up in that outfit no and i can already see the, the artist just loving this episode yeah blitz though seems to be having the worst of it moxie seems to have gotten through his a bit easier I can see that. Seriously! Do you have me put it in your Seriously! I will be a better friend than I was before. See, Moxie's handling this a little bit better than Blitz is. But still, the whole Peggy thing together, we can begin to become fine. Don't kiss, please. Please don't kiss. All right, thank God, the ladies. Oh, finally, the ladies. One on one, one on one. Oh my God, this place is incompetent as fudge. You guys gonna talk about it? Do you remember what you said to me after my first day with the company? Not really. I remember. You told me I did a good job and that you were proud to work with me. I feel like you wanted to say something more judgmental, but you said that because I needed it. And it helped. Look, I'm hard on you because I know what you're capable of, Mox. You care too much about what everyone thinks mm -hmm. except for me because, you know, my opinion is correct. But just <clears throat> keep doing a good job. See? Okay, you shoot and kill good, you escape things easy, 
You can be strategic and cold-blooded when you need to, and don't expect any more compliments. I'm maxed out. There you go. So, See, you know that, that's name. what we need. Use it. Thanks, Blitz. Oh. There's my Millie. Impressive work, Mills. How'd you get here all by yourself? Baby girl. Loony. Loony. Okay. All right. Oh, she's so hot. And sexy. <sighs> oh, this is about to get epic. This reminds me of uh, the Matrix. Reload it. When you open Smiths. Yeah! Let's do it! The kill him! Let's do it! Come on! Yeah! Go, baby! Destroy them! Destroy them! That's my baby girl! That's hot! Yeah! Yes! Destroy! Destroy! Oh, that's my other girl, Aunt yeah, Luna! Luna and Millie! Millie just wrecking it! <laughs> oh, the, the, the skills that pays the bills! Is a re I, I can see why Moxie lets her uh, peg him. Because uh, he ain't got no goddamn choice! There you go, there the boy's getting in that work! Point blank! That's what I'm talking about, Mox! Blitzel's just, <laughs> Blitzel's just styling and profiling. The teamwork! Ah, oh, it's so hot! Yes! Me too! Boom! 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 Slexy Slex! Oh no, she's good! She is all the way good! Slicing it! Slicing it! Slicing it! Slicing it! Slicing it! How about some water? Can I be squeezing your thighs? Then again... Uh, damn. Mealy, <laughs> mealy, yeah! Let's do it, Blitz! Nice! Nice! Boom! Explosion! Good God, why are we only using weapons from Japan's Edo period? Hey! The Edo period was badass and you know it! Damn it, you're right. That is true. Yeah, this might be a bad time for you guys, because they are just wrecking all your shits! <laughs> oh wow, really going for the dick there, ain't you? Yeah, I got it for you. Ow! Oh yeah, getting the hard one. Is everyone okay? Woo! How's that for demon scum? Red button? Red button. Oh shit, come on fam, let's blow this cocksicle joint. Oh no. Complete lockdown! Complete lockdown! Quick, the book! Shit, I can't I can't read the spell in this light. I can't see dick! You can see mine. Well shit. Looks like we milked this weapon tit dry. Is anybody nocturnal? They're going to destroy you! Like, you locked yourself with them! Don't you think that's that's an oversight on your part? Who dare my image? Oh, God. Stalus, is that you? Jesus. Well, that's, that's, uh... What's the matter, Demon Hunter? Never seen a real demon before. Jeez. The creepiness. Stolas, 
the man! This is the creepiest I've ever seen Stolas. Alright! Or is he just sending help? I can't really- uh, Yeah, that was him! There you go! Uh, yep, Stolas! And there we go. Yeah, uh-oh. Stolas? Well, well, hold on. How did you know that we needed help? I have my ways, darling. <laughs> oh, I'm fine, Stolas. Mm, good. How the fuck did you get caught by humans? Are you little creatures not being careful up here? You know, if you get in trouble, I get in trouble. We don't want that. They caught us off guard, your highness. Yeah, you can unclench your bird puss, Dolores. <laughs> Stop. Stop. For you, most don't believe the word of the demon-obsessed lunatics. They are seen as kooks. <laughs> kooks. Such a silly word. Now, let us all return. All right. Well, yes, please. There we go. I'd like to get back to the correct hellhole as soon as possible. <sighs> oh, this woman ends well, I guess. Am I going to get any thank you for the rescue, Bitsy? Well, I suppose you should. Want me to fuck your brains out tonight? Very much so. Ah! All right, but you're keeping quiet or I'm using those bear traps. Ugh. Oh, uh -huh. Oh, oh. Ah, stop it! Stop it! So what now? What now? We finally got the evidence we needed to be taken seriously. Nobody in corporate is ignoring this. <laughs> uh, yeah, they probably should have killed them. Yeah, that's an oversight they should have done. Probably should have killed these guys. Ooh. Well, all right, that's it. That is it, I believe. Yes, I, I think that is it. Wow, really good episode. Really enjoyed this. Some character growth on Moxie and Blitz side. I got to see my ladies fudge. Oh, fuck shit up. And it was amazing. Can I just say, I asked for more Luna, and they gave me a whole lot of loony booty. <laughs> so good, and... Come on, Millie. Uh, I'm getting torn now because Millie is just so... Mm. And we all know now, it's been revealed that Millie pegs Moxie. Yeah, I think that was the biggest reveal. <laughs> that had me freak out. I feel your pain, Moxie. And I guarantee you it's not willingly. I guarantee you the first time it wasn't willingly. It was forced. And they just happened to kind of like it. Oh, Moxie. Moxie, 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 Moxie. You poor fool. You poor deluded fool. But then again, it is Millie. Would I let Luna peg me? Probably not. But she'd probably force it on me. I don't know. I don't know. I'm stuck in hell already, so... Eh, eh. But yeah, I really enjoyed this episode. I don't know why I'd rank this. This is really good, though. This was actually really good. I, uh, I gotta admit, I, I really enjoyed this episode a lot. Um, the different animation styles they were going with. Uh, specifically with, um, Blitzo's end. Really interesting. Not to say I didn't like, uh, Moxie's version, because it was really good, too. But, yeah, Blitzo's I thought was just more interesting. And how did, I really, how did these incompetent, <laughs> these incompetent agents capture them? It was weird. I mean, I, I saw how they captured, but it was like, eh. But then, seeing how incompetent they are. But then again, they got the footage, so they're not that incompetent. Yeah, and Stola showing up, that was a really interesting surprise probably should have killed them though really should have killed them mm. Mm. and millie just using that axe was just badass just awesome i mean and luna was going and met right everybody was wrecking stuff moxie everybody the whole gang was just going in cohesive decisive now imagine them going against striker this way striker wouldn't have stood no chance against a squad like this in this capacity, but they didn't have the weapons they had. I mean, heck, look at Millie with just a knife was already doing stuff to strike her, but give her that axe! Uh, no! <laughs> no! Alright, well, uh, yeah, this was, uh, my reaction to, um, Hell of a Boss, Troop Seekers, Season 1, Episode 6. Let me know what you thought of this episode in the descriptions down below. I'm actually curious, and, uh, 
that's it for now, and I will see you all in my next reaction video. Ta-ta, take care, and goodbye, guys! We are